Police are asking for the public's help to solve a missing persons case. 34 year old Maria Miller disappeared in February of 2011, 2822. Eyewitness News I team reporter Andy Mahalshik joins us live from Bradford County now. Andy. Well, good morning, Sean. We're live at the State Police Headquarters here in North Tawanda Township, near Tawanda in Bradford County. State Police held a news conference just a short time ago. It ended basically asking for the public help in solving this missing persons now since 2011. Let me show you some a picture of the person they have been looking for. And they say this has been an active investigation for the last 12 years. Maria Nina Miller. She was 34 when she disappeared. They said she'd be 46 years old now. She was last seen at her place of work between the late on the night of February 4th and February 5th at the Dandy Mini Mart on Route 6 in White Sox. She had told uh, co-workers that she was going to go visit family in West Virginia. She was never seen again. She's believed to be driving at the time a Chevy Cobalt. Here's what the lead investigator had to say about when they urged the public to call in if they have any information. Here's what she said. We have reason to believe there are people with important information relevant to this case and we ask them to reach out. We do not believe that Maria left on her own, and there is someone that knows what happened. The contact information for tips are as follows. You can contact myself, uh, Trooper Miranda Music, at 570-265-2186, or you can contact the Criminal Investigation Assessment Unit at 570-822-5515. Now, this investigation involves the FBI, Crime Stoppers, and the Pennsylvania State Police. In fact, we're told that the U.S. Army, her husband was active duty at the time. U.S. Army actually reported her missing first. To one, the borough police got involved, then the FBI. Now, there was an original $5,000 reward. That's been up to $7,000 for information leading to any information on this case. Again, I asked them specifically, do they suspect foul play? They said, absolutely. Uh, they do believe somebody out there has some information. If you do call in, you don't have to give your name, but the information is what they need. 